My name is James Mwai. I work as the Deputy Director responsible for Policy, Sector, Incident Communication. I work with Kenya Commercial Forestry Program, which is a program set up by Gatsby Africa. Gatsby Africa is an institution which is mandated to look at sector transformation. And one of the areas we're looking at transforming is commercial forestry in Kenya. My name is Felix Magadju. I work with KCC as the end of programs. We were launching the first cohort of commercial forestry. Uh, where well, previously KCC has been working in uh, three thematic focus areas, and that is agribusiness, water, and, agri and uh, waste management. A couple of months ago, the board decided to include some two more uh, thematic areas, that is uh, waste management and commercial forestry. And so we had made a call for applications uh, a couple of months ago, and we got over 300 applications, touching on various innovations cutting across uh, diverse value chains in, in, in uh, commercial forestry. I'd like to just welcome all of you to our launch today. Um, it is really a pleasure to launch this cohort. Uh, we are excited to be collaborating with Gatsby Africa. We look forward to working this journey with you from 2020 to 2021 to ensure that we are able uh, to support you. We hope that you will greatly benefit from this experience, engagement, and also create awareness and visibility and impact within our sectors. We have agreed to have a boot camp on the 21st, 23rd, this month. We want to do things very quick. And somebody is asking what about the boot camp. Well, a couple of things will happen there. Um, of course, we'll be having KCC, Gatsby, and then a couple of other resource persons uh, talking to us. This is essentially is a deep dive of what is needed. For the next one year, every enterprise will be allotted a business analyst to be able to work with you for the next one year. We decided to expand in what we call Kenya Climate Innovation Center Strategy 3, which is about 50 million US dollar strategy for the next five years to include commercial forestry as part of the sector that we carry. If we can go through for commercial activities, we get two things of three things. One, first of all, we will be one very important. We will be able to provide future generations with a better world than we found it. Number two, it means that we are going to create economic empowerment. And the third thing is that our country is going to benefit in different aspects. One, this was talking about foreign exchange, how we can be able to save foreign exchange, we can be able to produce it locally. I think it's no secret KCIC have been a standard bearer in supporting enterprise in realising their potential through climate compatible innovations for over a decade. And they are a proven model and providing much needed investment, but just as critically world class enterprise incubation services. So as such, we are extremely proud as an organisation and a programme to be collaborating with Edward and his accomplished team in this current initiative targeting Kenya's commercial forestry sector. Each of you have a unique service offering to bring to the table. There's undoubtedly some brilliant minds in the room, but arguably the greatest strength of this initiative is that it is supporting an entire ecosystem of enterprises. Our programme, the Kenyan Commercial Forestry Programme, stands ready to work alongside KCIC to support each of you in your individual and collective journey. So to finish by congratulating the selected businesses whilst recognizing that the hard work really lies ahead. Commercial forestry is a vital link to other sectors that we think are more important to the economy. If you're asked which are the leading sectors for the economy, you will all talk about tea, horticulture and so forth. But do you know there's a direct link between commercial forestry and tea? The challenge which you have risen up to was to suggest, to propose, to begin to have started innovations in commercial forestry that could go to scale. You are the entrepreneurs, you are the ideas people. Our role is to provide the backdrop, provide you with access to some of this information, and of course through KCIC, provide you with an incubator program. But collectively, we will rise to address not just the demand, because growing demand is easy, I'm very happy in what we are doing, that we make forest to be a business, a business which can compete with any other business. 
So we are committed and we are working to the gospel and uh, we shall deliver. We have the best climate in the world for growing timber. And we need it to have a self-sufficient policy. I would like to see forestry redeveloped. We're very eager that after the end of those 12 months, that these 32 businesses will actually be successful businesses. There are two elements of success. The first element of success will be they'll be successful as, as incubators. But then the most important element of success will be three years from now, five years from now, having gone through this and graduated from this particular cohort, what will be the state of their businesses? So we're looking forward to looking at these businesses in 2025, where we think they'll be maybe 10 times or 15 times, even 20 times larger than they are now because they have that growth potential. Thank you, KCIC, for this courage. Thank you for partnering with us. I want to thank my team who've worked with me tirelessly to get us to this particular point and this particular launch. And I want to appreciate the 32, actually I want to first appreciate all the businesses who applied because everybody took some time to be able to apply online during this particular season. And from that, I want to thank those who were actually successful. I want to take this opportunity to appreciate um, the management of KCC first and foremost, uh, and then the management of Gatsby Trust, and also to support, to appreciate the, the, the role played by the clients who were able to turn up for the launch. Uh, we are looking forward to really supporting you for the next one year and supporting you in terms of advisory services and access to finance, and to ensure that the products that they are producing, we are being able to you know support them in terms of access to market, so we'll be able to market their products. Thank you.